Hello, hello YouTube, this is AOTX5, this is to show you how to do the um, infinite money glitch on FIFA 11 career mode. Um, so, this is working as of August 2011. So yeah, first of all, you want to go on to system settings, then you go on to memory, this is to delete the patch to stop you from doing it. Go on to whatever memory unit you've got it on, I have to have it on my hard drive. Go on to FIFA 11, and then you want to find this. This is the update that's stopping you from doing it. So yeah, this will reset all the squads as well. So if you really want to like do it with all the up to date squads like Torres with Chelsea, then you already have started the career mode and then come back onto your dashboard, go on system settings and memory, FIFA eleven and delete this. And then once you've deleted this, go back go back onto the to the dashboard and load up FIFA. And with FIFA, it will ask you to download the update again, but you click cancel. This will like stop the patch from working. Sorry about the crappy like quality. My bad. It's my phone that I'm doing on at the minute. So yeah, just wait for this to load up. Sorry, I'm making noises. So yeah, you can do this with any team really, it's just that they need to have a loaned in or out player. But I'll, sh I'll show you why in a sec. So yeah, just, you don't have to sign in Textbox Live for this or anything. Um, you can use it online though, like, you can be signed in to use this, it won't do anything. So you only want to go into game modes. New career or just load up a career if you've already got it and you want to use the infinite, infinite money glitch on this. It's not really infinite, it's like you get like 2 billion to spend and like 40 million in contracts. So you can use on player manager or just normal manager. I'll just show you how to do this with um, Burry because they've got a loan in player and they're low league. Just to prove that it works for anybody. Um, so yeah, you can, you can do it whatever you want. These settings don't really affect how it's done. Um, so yeah, I'm just like skipping to quickly to come through this. Just wait for this to work. So yeah, this is working because they say that to delete the patch you have to um, clear your cache. That doesn't work now. You have to actually delete the patch physically. So yeah, I'll just go through this. Yep, yep. And now you want to go on to transfers it's just to check that you've got players. I have loaned in there. You see that guy there, T Thomas Lee's at the top. I think that's his name. And uh, he's loaned in. So yeah, you want to go on to budget allocation after that to check in. You want to make it so the new transfer budget goes right down to zero. Uh, um, zero. The ratio is zero to one hundred. So yeah, and then you want to press A to allocate the budget. And you want to go to sell players. You want to click on Thomas Lee's and end loan. Yes, end loan. Now, if you look in the top left-hand corner, it says transfer budget. It's minus 13,000. That's what you want it to be. Don't worry if it's like that. Now, you want to go back into budget allocation. And if you look in, the, it should be the ratio should be 99 to 1. And look, it's 2 billion, 147 million, 483. Hundred thousand and five hundred and twenty pounds as a new transfer budget. Now you want to move this to fifty fifty. Don't worry, the new transfer budget doesn't change from two billion. Only when you go past it, I usually have it at like forty sixty. So you got like a very healthy sum, and, it, and it usually it's, it's it's good. So yeah. So now you've got your your two. Got you one billion. You can have as much as you want. To be honest with you, it doesn't really matter the ratio. That's how I have it. And if ever that goes to minus in the top left-hand corner, see up there. If ever that goes up into minus, then all all you've got to do here yeah, is change. Is go back onto budget allocation and change it to something else. It doesn't matter at all. It doesn't affect it at all. And you can just do this. You can keep doing that glitch over and over again. So if you run out of funds, say like buy Ronaldo, or you can't buy Messi. I'll just tell you that now. It's physically impossible to buy him. I'm telling you, it's stupid, man. 
So yeah, once you've done that, you can just go in, connect Xbox Live, shine back in. See, so yeah, I'm shining back in. Yep, download the update. So yeah, that's the infinite money glitch. Thanks for watching. All works. Just wait for the download to take place. It'll all load back up again, and all what you gotta do is just take you back to there. And all you gotta do is go all through this again, go into game modes, load up your career mode that you've just glitched, and buy whatever you want. Yeah, thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe, and leave your comments in below. See ya. Cheers. Bye.